tour at the wicked whoopee place right now i'm trying to get out on i think this is main street we came down main street and michael turned around he said i'm not going down there so he's going back to the grocery store and i'm going to pick him up i think i can get out now and we're going to go down to the whoopee pie place we're only about 30 minutes from our campground that Michael found the one I found when we got to service where I could look at it it's an adult only campground so that's not gonna work and then um, another one I called was completely booked so thankfully Michael found one that has laundry and full hookups so we're gonna go start some laundry shower and go out to eat um, our realtor gave us a gift card to Texas Roadhouse and there's one here in Portland so we're excited to use that and I don't know how long it's been since we've ate out I know how long it's been since we've had showers five days and <laughs> we've had no hookups I have washed my hair but other than that I stink and the kids let's see James had a shower this morning and Holden and Michael got one last night but then we ran out of water so when we're not hooked up we try to reserve water and try not to fill up the tanks so um, we made it to the last day um, thankfully but we have a lot 
of dishes to wash now since we ran out of water. But oh well, we'll deal with that when we get there. That's what you want? Lemon? You want lemon? There you go, watch that. Strawberry. Here's what we got. Now, the one I had in Acadia. Where were we? Um, whatever that little town was, it was better than this. What's it taste like? What's up? <laughs> we are in Freeport, Maine. We are headed to. Have you already talked about all that stuff? Uh, yeah. So, anyway, so y'all already know, know where we're headed. Um, we are trying to get back to the camper actually. Right yeah, now. out of Freeport. And, yes, and these glasses have my ears pushed down. Alright, so, <clears throat> oh wow, there's our, 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 there's that one was behind. Um, we parked the camper at a grocery store before we got in town because it looked like it was super crowded. And it was, um, apparently there's some kind of festival or something mm -hmm. going on. Um, look, there's L.O. Bean Davis Warehouse. Warehouse. That's pretty cool. Anyway, we went to the Whoopie Pie place. Wicked Whoopie Pie. Wicked Whoopies. Wicked Whoopies. And, uh, yeah, Wicked Whoopies. And it was not great. It's overrated. Yeah. Um, the lemon filled one was good. And we have a blueberry one we haven't it, tried yet. It looks like it's going to be good. Yeah. They look more homemade than the other ones. The other ones look like mass produced factory snacks. And that ain't what we like normally. That ain't what we used to. So we, we saved you a trip. Don't don't try it. It's not that great. That's right. <laughs> Unless you get the lemon one. The one we got on the back road in Acadia was, in our gas was, station. was uh, better. Excellent. It was really good. But, I mean, it was homemade, made by two old women who know what they're doing. You know what I mean? Not some machine that doesn't know what it's doing. So... Anywho. So there's that. Now we're going to try to get to the campground, get some laundry going, showers, and go have dinner. It's Hopefully. Texas Roadhouse. We got a gift card. Yeah, I told them already. Oh. Okay. Y'all already know all this Thanks, stuff. Felicia. <laughs> now bye, Felicia. you don't know who LJMJ is um, they're a family on YouTube and I, we really didn't even know about them until a few months ago when my friends told me about it and I checked them out and loved their videos so the whole time we were trying to sell our house and 
waiting on our closing date. Like we were soaking up all the videos we could. We watched um, their Alaska playlist and the kids, that really made the kids want to go to Alaska. So um, anyway, they're such a sweet family. And we, um, we heard that they were coming to Maine and we weren't sure like what, if they would get here before we left. So we've just been kind of waiting, watching, seeing what was gonna happen. And um, they posted this week that they're gonna be having a meetup in Maine. So I think they're actually, they're on their way out of Maine too. So they must have did a really quick trip. Anyway, we're excited that we get to see them. Well, we <clears throat> are to our boondocking spot at Mount Washington in New Hampshire. And it was quite fun getting up the road to get here, but we are in a spot all by ourselves and it's nice. But uh, so we went to Maine Portland Mall to see Less Junk More Journey. Nathan and Marissa. Mm -hmm. All right. I'm horrible with names. And uh, <clears throat> while we were there, we met some other friends who full time RV, so we'll probably be meeting up with them some other time. But um, so Nathan and Marissa were really nice, and uh, we got to talk to them a little bit. It wasn't too crowded, it wasn't mm -hmm. too bad. <laughs> we expected a lot more people, but you know, it's, I mean, it's Maine, so there's not a ton of people in Maine. <laughs> <clears throat> and probably not a ton of people, you know, they're fans of them, so, but, uh, in Maine, what? so. Yeah, I was about to say, they have a lot of fans. I know they have a ton of fans, <laughs> but I mean Maine, you know. Yeah. Like, <clears throat> I mean, they don't even Maine. have service in half the state, Yeah, so. Maine is not a good place for young people, or it's not a popular place for young yeah, people to live. We just seen that the other day. <laughs> so, we're glad we went to the meetup. Um, we've been, you know, kind of in the woods for a little while for at least a week yeah it was getting pretty lonely um so it was really neat to not only meet um nathan and marissa and hensley and jj but also um some other full-time people who were there and you know make connections with people and start relationships where you know we can uh, meet up later and travel <clears> with them <throat> some so that's really neat is getting to meet people yeah that do the same thing we do mm -hmm. you know because there's not a lot of people that do this especially in our age bracket you know most people are older and retired so that we've seen so far <clears throat> yeah, i mean so far, yeah there yeah. is quite a few people who do it who are younger but just not around here not around where we've not been Maine, so yeah. far so but yeah that was really neat so um we're gonna be here for a couple of days in New Hampshire and go up to Mount Washington so but now what are we gonna go eat yeah I guess we'll eat and we really need to wash our vehicles because they are <laughs> disgusting and that makes my left eye twitch the dirt roads were, oh, man. were great in Maine oh it just makes everything nasty like goodness gracious so you know how all like people from up north, all their vehicles look like they just got salt caked all over them. Well, that's what ours look like right now. Mm, anyway, yeah, salt and dirt. <clears throat> so, you gotta get all that washed off. Go get a we got an empty propane bottle. I'm gonna take care of that. And uh, that's about it, I guess. Yeah, hang out, hit some trails. Maybe I'm tired, later. I'm just ready to chill. <laughs> all right, hey, we'll catch y'all later. <laughs>